Hey, I am Brett Lee Clark, and in today's video, we are going to unbox the Ghostface action figure. Yeah, I have more action figures to unbox, but I figured this is a good starting point. Um, so I guess we just get started. Here's the box. Got my buck 120. Wow. Is she gonna focus on you? Wow, look at there. Yeah. Okay, so we're opening this. Um, so you're probably new here because I have like five subscribers. So, um, this is my first, uh, like, unboxing, well, I unbox a Chucky doll, so if you want to watch that, I'm sure it's somewhere, you can watch me unbox my Chucky doll, but that was from a few years ago. I've gotten a little better at doing videos since then. Um, I am a major Scream fan. Um, yeah, I got lots of Scream stuff. Should I put this on the phone? I got this book. I got a Scream mask, and it's autographed by somebody. These are real autographs. And we'll just say it's two of the opening kills from the trilogy. So, two people who die in the opening. I wanted to save this for a different video because I have other autographed stuff. But this is the only thing that's actually really autographed. The other stuff is fake. So, I'm going to save this for a different video. But if you want to know who did this, subscribe and stick around. I have a horror movie room that I will show you like right now. show you some. I don't want to give it all away at one time because I want to do like multiple videos using the stuff in my horror movie room. If you like horror movies, regular movies, cooking, true crime, any of that stuff, subscribe because I have plenty more videos coming soon. Um, but yeah, today's video we're going to unbox this. Um, I don't know what else to say. We'll talk about Scream 5 or Scream, however they want to call it. I should like add a knife. Like, okay. So I actually already have one of these. It's just, I didn't want to open the only one I had. So I bought a second one to unbox it. Can you see? I guess I should, hold on. It's unboxing. It's upside down, it's not as good. Hold on, let me turn it around for you. And oh, look what we got there in the box. Wow, wow. I've yet to see these at Target or anywhere. I'm not sure if they're like not sold in stores yet, but. I did find another ghost face in Target one time that's not in this type of packaging, it's in a clear packaging. I mean, I'll show a picture of it right here. Real quick, okay, this is the one I was talking about. See, I randomly found this at Target one day. There was no other ones around. There wasn't even a section for it. And it was at Target. I guess this is their first edition because this is also made by the same people. Ghost face, there's the back of the box. You wanna see the back of it? Um, but I only ever found one of those, so I kept that one in the box. But this is Ghostface, yeah. So this is the front of the box, Ghostface. By NECA Toys, NECA, 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 yeah. Okay, by them. And this is the back of the box. Oh, wow. There's the front of the box and the side of the box. And of course, nowhere on here does it say the word scream, ever. Oh, well, this one's better than the one I have. Okay. Can you open it up? Dun, 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 dun. And we got ghost space over here. And then we got this ghost space right there. And then this one, one of these glows in the dark. And I guess this one. And now it's open. I'm so excited. I When I got my other one, I was so annoyed that I didn't. I wanted to open it, but I didn't want to open it, but I did want to open it. So, oh, should we get this? Wait, I'm gonna stab myself trying to stab this coolie. Uh. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay. So, let's open her up, shall we? Can you see all this? Should I change the, I guess it's the same. Um, <clears throat> so while I'm opening this, I guess we should talk about Scream 5, or Scream, which this is my thing. If you're gonna like, like we all call the new Halloween, Halloween H, or Halloween H, Halloween 2018. So why not call it Scream 2022? And just have, oh, look, can you see these little fringes hanging off the back of him? Oh, look at your little fringes. Okay, <laughs> hold on, I'll stop talking for a second. And look, can you see this? Oh God, he's falling. Hold on, oh, look at how cute he is. So he comes with multiple knives. 
which this isn't even a buck 120, but it kind of looks like the buck 120, but it's not. So it comes with multiple knives. And they say, oh, yeah, and a sickle. So everyone's like, why is, why is there a sickle with it? Blah, blah, blah. So it's supposed to be, what I've heard, it's, but at least, is that it's based off of the ghost face, like Father Death, the one that Scream used from Funhouse. Like the mask they used, this was like the interpretation of what the costume was supposed to symbolize. But he has a voice changer. So it's like, are you Scream or are you not Scream? Because did you have plan on the guy having a voice changer when, before Scream came out? I doubt it. So why does he have a voice changer now? It doesn't make any sense. So, and then on the box, nowhere on the box does it ever say anything about Scream. It always just says Ghostface. So they're making a crap ton of money off of licensing Licensing, licensing, license, lice, I can't say it. I know how to say it. I know what to say, but I can't say it. Licen, licensed, licensing. Nope, okay, never mind. Okay, so we're opening this. This little piece comes off. Ten. Oh, oh my god, we're losing something. Losing hands. Losing hands. Can I get a hand? Can I get a hand? Huh? <laughs> oh my god, I'm losing knives. Oh, Jesus Christ, losing the sickles. So, should I like, do this closer up or something? I'm confused. Hold on. I don't know how to do unboxing. I'm, should I do it close? Do you not cover my face? It's kind of like a... It looks a little bit like... Uh, can you see this? I won't be one of those people. Okay, see? It looks a little bit like a buck 120, but it's not really, because if you look at the handle, it's not. Unless they, they just forgot to color it in. I don't know. But it's kind of like the same knife, I guess. I guess it's the same idea. See that? And then you got like a Michael Myers butcher knife. Wow. Wow. You got a little Michael Myers butcher knife. And then another knife that's like a hunting knife. There you go. <laughs> that does not look right. But there you go. You get the idea. A little hunting knife. Okay. And then a sickle. Because, you know, when you think about ghost space, you can think about a sickle. So there's a little sickle. I love the detail they put into this. Like, it's amazing. Can you see there's like, it's like dirty wood on there? You see the dirty wood? Isn't that so cool? Yeah, so a sickle. And then you got two little hands. And then two little hands. I think one holds the sickle. Okay, so what was it? Uh, hold on, two seconds. <sighs> Give me a second. So why? Well, what I was saying about Scream Five was that, like, if you're gonna like name a movie the same name as the original, why don't you just put the year on there? Why can't all movies just be the year? So like. Instead of Fast and the Furious 9, have like Fast and the Furious, whatever year, whatever, 2017, whenever it came out, I don't know. But all screams could be done by the year, so it could be like, Scream 2022, and then part two of the new series could be like, Scream 2026, Scream 2030, and you'd be like, which one's your favorite? I'm like, Scream 2052, and are like, oh, when, when Sydney has grandkids, and the ghost face come after Sydney's grandkids, like, yeah, that's my favorite one. So see, just do it that way, and then it won't matter. Anyway. Okay, so this is, <laughs> you're like, what are you talking about? This is my little guy. He's gonna come out with his little packaging. Okay, so should I bring his heads out first, I guess? So each head. Uh, can you see that? Can you see my little face head? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my God, I'm breaking this stuff. Hold on. Okay, we're gonna try this angle and see if this works better, huh? Okay, so here he is. Okay, what did I lose? Hold on. We got heads. We got a fallen head. Okay. So this head is like a blood-soaked head. Ah, can you see that? This is my first like real roll unboxing. Get out of there. Okay. Ta -da. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Is it Mrs. Loomis? No. <laughs> it's Billy. So you look up close, he has brown shoes on. Which I feel like in the movies he always had black, but maybe he had brown sometimes. Brown shoes on. He got his little pants on, see, yeah. 
pants and brown shoes. His jeans are a little messed up in the back and make it look real. It looks like he can bend his legs. Hold on. Oh, he can bend his legs. <gasps> can y'all see that? Hold on. They've not been very far, but they've been. Uh, uh, uh. And it feels like his little feet are on balls, but yeah. Okay. So that's him. Look at him. Look. This is his head. I'm guessing if you pull this off. Yeah, that's how you can change the head out. I'm gonna do it wrong. I'm gonna break it. Oh, okay, so his head just pops off like a Barbie doll. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. You can pop on a different one. Let's do stab. Oh wait, there's four heads. I didn't realize, I'm so stupid. Since he was already wearing a head, I'm like, oh, he only has three heads, but now he has four heads because he's already wearing a head. So, if you wanna do a stab guy, Ta-da! I need to talk about Scream 5 more. So who do you guys think is the killer? I think I already have, I already have predictions as to who I think the killer is. Because like, if you have certain um, big name actors, it's like either they're the killer or I lost the knife! Are they going to last? I don't know, maybe not. I'll stop talking. Look at that, look. Can you see the inside? <gasps> it's like a little wind. Wow, look inside. It's like a little window we're opening up. Okay, so this is him wearing his green mask. Wow, look at him wearing his green mask. So I'm not, I'm really bad at this. Hello, hi. This is my first one. I got plenty of more Scream stuff coming. I'm about to, I'm gonna do all these in just a second. I'm gonna do every one individually and give them their own different personalities. Because we got four masks and we got four weapons. So we're gonna, well no, we only have three. Nope, we have four, I'm crazy. So we got four masks and four weapons. So I'm gonna put them all together and do different ones. Look, okay, finally. Finally it's happened to me, ta -da. Okay, so yeah, this is his first look. Yeah, it's look pretty, is it cute? Ta-da, give him a voice changer. Can you see the voice changer? This is the voice changer, in case you wanna see it up close, hold on. Ah. We'll focus on that. See a little voice changer? The back of it has a little speaker. Can you see that? Hopefully. So that's the voice changer. So we're gonna put this in this hand so we can talk to somebody. Uh, I don't know why it'd be this far out. Maybe it's the garage door opener. Maybe it's the little clicker thing from Scream 3 that locks the door. Lock Sydney in the back room. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, yeah. Uh, he's doing a split. Okay. So this we're just gonna stop here. This is my first look. Wow. Look at Ghostface looking slick with his green mask on. Can you tell it's green? Hold on. Let me turn the light down and see. Ooh. Oh. I mean, that's better this whole time. I should have the light turned down. Okay. So wait, intermission. I have other stuff to unbox coming up. This, I want to unbox this. My friends from California got it for me. Hey, Val and Kyle. They got it for me. I hope I want to unbox it. But then I don't want to unbox it. But I do want to unbox it. So I might unbox this coming up. Yeah. And then... I'm pretty sure like my next video that gets posted is gonna be either me unboxing this Jason because I have a bunch of these already but this one comes with a gravestone so I wanted to unbox that one because it comes with Pamela Voorhees' gravestone or I want to unbox this one because it has a fire with it and her and Mrs. Voorhees' head. Where's that? Yeah, Mrs. Voorhees' head. And you have Jason with a mask on. And it has a cool fire, see? So I kind of want to unbox this one so I have a fire to go along with my horror stuff. So if you want to see those, I'll get, I'll get better at unboxing, I promise. I promise. I'm just, I'm just trying hard right now. Yeah. Also, with this, I have um, the prop version also. So we can do a little, we can do a little guess which one's real. This one's real. Guess which one's not. So there's this ghost face now, and then we're gonna give this one the sickle, I guess. 
because he looks like he most he most deserves the sickle. Which kind of does, how does he hold it? Oh my god, I'm so bad at this. Okay, so here's my, oh wait, nope, okay. This may not be how he holds the hold. Yeah, oh look at that, that's good, huh? So yeah, this is the bloody ghost face. Which, if you think about it in the movies, they never actually show him like that bloody. Like there's been some blood on his mask. It needs to be like covered like this for like the whole last half. You know what I mean? The little blood spot or and it's had like the last half of it. It's covered. So you gonna focus on him? Oh look at that. Dun, dun, dun. Bing, bing, bing. Look at there. Wow. Regular ghost face. Oh, let me fix that. Yeah, yeah. I made him a lefty. So he's a lefty. Because it fit better in that hand. But see this one's like a like a hunting knife almost. Cause that's like a wood, ugh. it has like a wood handle, it's hard to see. But this is a wood handle. Yeah. Yeah, but it has like the same idea as a Puck 120. But yeah. okay. So, one, <laughs> we got regular ghost face. We got a knife that looks like a hunting knife that has a wooden handle. We have two extra hands, oh, we got two extra hands. We have a bloody ghost face. A glow-in-the-dark green ghost face slash stab looking ghost face and then we have a Halloween 2018 zombie looking ghost face we have a voice changer we got a butcher knife very like Michael Myers looking and we have something that looks similar to a buck 120 but not really um, but very similar if it was like colored correctly it could be it um, and then a sickle because it's father death and that was his original weapon even though mine Broke. What is this? Mm. That okay. That was the end of this video of me unboxing this little guy. Look how cute he is. Oh, he's so cute. So if you want to see me unbox more stuff or talk more about Scream, uh, subscribe and stick around. I'm probably am gonna unbox my little ghost face tune guy. Yeah, shall I unbox him? Uh, thanks, Vel and Kyle, for this. And look at the back of it. It's like it looks like the garage door from part one. Huh? You see that? Yeah. So I may undo, I may unbox that one soon. I won't be unboxing this one, but it looks cool. And we already unboxed this one. I'm gonna unbox these next, or at least one of them, maybe both. I'm gonna unbox them though, but if you want those, stick around, subscribe. I don't know what else to say. This is a terrible video. I am sorry, it's my first unboxing. I feel like the background's way too much too. I need a different area. Maybe I'll just do it in the movie room. We'll see, okay. Thank you so much, Brett Lee Clark. Subscribe, like it, stick around for more stuff, cooking, Horror movies, <laughs> horror and movies are together. Horror movies, cooking, horror and horror movies, and regular movies, and true crime, and some other stuff. And yeah, so stick around. Okay, bye. Thanks so much. <laughs>